Go. Good morning, everyone. And uh, and we are here in the mission field of the Philippines doing the great thing, the will of God in our lives. Me and my beloved hubby, missionary, Pastor Frank Williams, of course, is doing such uh, wonderful things in the Philippines. And, uh, we are greeting a uh, blessed Christmas to everyone, okay, in the Philippines and all over the world, okay, and um, stay with us as we continue to do the, the go live for today, as this is the sun's day, yeah, and we need to worship the most high God in our lives, so can maybe you can sing the song we need to have this pure heart before we go in the presence of the Lord who will ask a pure heart that he will cleanse us before we continue to be in his presence. Sing with us also. A pure heart. That's what I long for. A heart that follows hard after thee. Yes, one more time. A pure heart. A pure heart. That's what I Yeah. 
Yes, presence. Lord. Because we Thank want you, your mighty Thank presence you. to be filled our whole being, oh Lord. We want you to be with us. Hallelujah. And we want to feel your presence and to the brim. Hallelujah. Continue to bless us, oh Lord. As you continue to honor your presence. Hallelujah. Yes. In the midst of your people. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen.
Rabasikara Sikara Bayan. Hallelujah, bless your holy name, O Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Lord, you know that we are just fighting for more spirit. Hallelujah. Amen. The Praise God. Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And we need your wisdom. And we need your power. Hallelujah. As we continue yes. to serve you, we need to be, uh, we, we need to have a true love to each other. Yes. Da, da, da. For each other. Hallelujah. Yes. yes Lord. Because we want you to touch us. We want you to restore your church. Hallelujah. Yes. Touch us, restore your church mightily, boldly, and powerfully in the name of Jesus.
humans to live as a family unit. Hallelujah. He know that we would have many ups and downs in our own lives and families either. But the Lord had promised that He would never leave us nor forsake us. Amen. So our family likewise. Amen. Okay. <laughs> I need something. <laughs> Hallelujah. And um, I have some verses here to inspire every family who is watching there today or watching there tonight in the other side of the world. Yes. Hallelujah. I have some uh, verses for the family that the Lord had given me. First and foremost, in Ephesians chapter 5, verse 25, it says here, Hallelujah. Yes. Husbands, love your wives just as Christ loved the church and gave himself up for her. Amen. Amen. Because the parents, the husband is the head of the family. Hallelujah. And so the Lord had advised the husbands to love their wives. Just how faithful is Christ loved the church that he gave himself up for the church. So husbands 
is encouraged to do likewise. All right. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah. And in 1 Corinthians chapter 4 to 8, as I want to read it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I had not prepared it to open it here. Okay. And I have that, my love. Yes, I have to. My Bible was upside down. Ah, okay. First Corinthians chapter 4. Verse. Yeah, First Corinthians 13. First Corinthians chapter 13. Yes, my love. All right. Verses 4 through 8. All right, this is in the King James yeah, Version. Okay. Some would call it the Living Bible. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, charity suffers long and is kind, because charity sometimes means no. love. Yeah. Charity suffers long and is kind. Charity envieth not. Charity mm -hmm. vaunteth not itself. It is not puffed up, mm. does not behave itself unseemly, uh, seeks not mm. her own, is not easily provoked, mm. uh, thinketh no evil, yeah. rejoices not in iniquity, Amen. but rejoices in the truth, Amen. bears all things, Believes all things, hopes all things, Amen. endures all Amen. things. Amen. Charity never fails. Amen. But whether there be prophecies, yes, whether there be prophecies, Amen. whether there be prophecies, <laughs> they shall fail sometimes. Yeah. Whether there be tongues, they shall cease. Whether there be knowledge, it shall vanish away. Yeah. Even though, how many gifts do you have in your life? Okay? When there is no love, everything is nothing. That's right. Because love is the greatest gift of all. Yes. But every gift you have from the Lord is a minister or a believer of God. If you hold no love in in your heart, yes, you have no love. All that gifts is no prize at all in the sight of God. Yeah, praise the Lord. Love yes, love is the greatest gift of all. Amen. Thank you, my love, for reading it. So love is always patient, and love is always kind. Yes. <laughs> Hallelujah. And that is a good thing that uh, uh, we can be seen in every household. And there is patience and there is kindness. Wow. There is always peace inside the household. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Romans chapter 12, verse 9. Romance. Ro romance? Romance. Okay. Chapter 12, verse 9. Let love be genuine. Let love be genuine, desiring to please God's heart always. So, because there are four kinds already of love. Yes. Yeah. But the best of them all is the genuine love, which we call it. It is from God's love, which they co we call it agape love. Yes. It is the pure love. Amen? Hallelujah. In 1 John 4, 19, we love because God first loved us. Amen? Amen. Is, he is the author. He is the author of love because God is love. 1 John 4, 19, we love because He first loves us. Yes. God is the first cause of all that is good and right in the world. 
Wherever and whenever love exists on earth, it only exists because it is a reflection of God's perfect love that created us and that sustains us. That's a wonderful word from the Lord. Amen? That's right. Hallelujah. Amen. <laughs> and if only people in the world love one another, there is no bombing at all happening in every area of the world. That's right. If people is... in the church yeah. love one another, yeah, of course, my we Lord. can do more for the kingdom. Amen. We quit competing with our brothers and sisters and work as a team. Yes. We Amen. can rock the world. Amen. Amen. We can turn the world upside down for Jesus. Yes. Because we love one another. Yes. We're people that love love one another. Yes. Even though in sunshine or in rain. Yes. People must know that we must love one another. What is sunshine? Sunshine means blessings. And yes. rain is still blessings, but sometimes there is drought, and sometimes there is uh, flooding, right? Mm -hmm. That uh, that kills people, and uh, and lost our blessings. But uh, when there is love, there right. is always victory Amen. in every circumstances. Amen. Amen. Okay, so let's continue. And so, according to the book of first Corinthians 13, 13 so now faith hope and love abide this three okay but the greatest of this is love why because God had given us the faith to believe in him God has given us the hope to trust in him yes but for most God has given us the love to let us feel the passion for the many. He wants everyone to continue loving one another. He wants everyone to have a genuine love with one another. Yes. Not biting one with another. Great. <laughs> love one another so that our family would be a great blessing to everyone wherever we are wherever we go our, the glorious presence of the lord is in our family it is in our household and our household is a small church it is a small churches where god uh, must uh, must decide to live in the center of our household yes and the churches is a big family in the society amen yes. and we need to love one another we are not to compete one with another because we have one God then that we serve that, that God is the God of love yes. he is the author of love yes. and so if you hate your brothers and sisters in the Lord as well i don't think that you are really serving the right god right. of this world mm -hmm. the right god who lives in our heart the right god who is rejoicing when we are in the spirit of unity in uh, psalms 133 verse 1 and behold how good and pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity. Right. Right. Because where there is unity, there is love and there is peace. Amen? Right. And that is what Satan doesn't like when we have unity and we have peace. That Satan doesn't want it because uh, Satan doesn't want it because Satan wants trouble, 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 trouble all the time. That's Satan right. is a war threat. And so if a ha of your household or if your church is a war freak, always remember that that is not the spirit of God living in that place. Amen. Open rebuke is better than sacred love. Hallelujah. So let's continue in 1 Corinthians 13 13. Mm -hmm. Okay? 
So now faith, hope, and love abide this tree. But the greatest of this is love. Yes. The Corinthians are wondering whose spiritual gifts are greater and better than the others in order to establish some sort of superiority. Oh, the Lord did not give us the gifts so that we will become the superior. Hallelujah. Amen. To, to anyone, Ill, uh, anyone else or, or to our fellow brethren in the Lord, fellow hello family no, no. God doesn't want it he did not establish that so that we would boast it to anyone that we are better than them Amen. okay but Paul follows up their intentions and questions with chapter 13 of the book of Corinthians that's what Paul had able to exhort the first Corinthians uh, yeah, first Corinthians 13, 1 to 13. Okay? Um, telling them that they need to love one another. Just so simple as that. If you have the gift of everything, you have the speaking in tongues, you have the spirit to, to move mountains, hallelujah. Oh, you have all the wisdom and knowledge, but you have not love. But you have no love in your heart. There's no passion at all. Without God's love, everything in you is useless. Right. There is nothing in the sight of God. Because in 1 John 4, 7 and 8, this is always a song in your yes. heart. Yes. Let us love one another for love is of God. And everyone that loveth is born of God. Love of God, yes. Yeah. Everyone that loveth is born of God and knoweth God. He know God. Amen. He that loveth not knoweth not God for God is love. If yes. you don't love, if you don't know how to love, you don't know who God is. That's right. Because you don't know what is love. Amen. The, the world is full of hatred. Yes. There are families that their household is full of hatred. There are churches now that their spirit is full of hatred. They gather together, but their spirit is full of hatred. It is full of fancy inside the church. Yes. The spirit of God doesn't dwell in that place at all because... Where there is no unity, the Spirit of God dwelleth not. That's right. But when there is unity, there is love. And yes. Everyone know that God is love. That is why everyone love one another. Yes. Amen. Hallelujah. So, their friends let us love one another again in another version. For love comes from God. Everyone who loves has been born of God and knows God. No one has ever seen God. Right. But if we love one another, God lives in us. He does. Yeah. We know that we live in Him and He in us. Because yes. we know how to love. Yes. A genuine love. Amen. Not, not, a, not a fancy love. Not a fancy yeah. love. Yeah. Just a... Because He has given us of oh, His Spirit. His Spirit yes. lives within us. And His Spirit always teaches us how to be meek, how to be patient, how to have hope, how to have faith, hallelujah, yes. and foremost, how to love and have compassion yes. for one with another. Yes. Amen? And so, in um, Proverbs chapter 3, 3 to 4, it says, it says here, huh? Let love and faithfulness never leave you. Why? It was said like that. Because love is God. If you leave God, you will lose the love. If you lost love, you have no God. That is just... That is the, the result. 
Let love and faithfulness never leave you. Bind them around your neck. Yes. Write them on the tablet of your heart. Yes. Heart. 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 Yes. Amen. <laughs> because there is two kinds of heart. Heart. Hurt. Heart. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Amen. As a husband, okay, as a husband, shows love and faithfulness to his wife, so a wife should show love and faithfulness to her husband. I love you very much, my love. Mm -hmm. I love you very much. Okay. Love you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> God is the husband and his people are the wife or his bride. Yes. His faithfulness results in our trust in his character. Hmm? Yes. Knowing him allows us to put our faith in him. Yes. So the conclusion of the message today is in Proverbs chapter 3, 5 to 6. Yes. Okay. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Yes. And lean not on your own understanding. And in all your ways acknowledge God or submit to Him. Because once we acknowledge God, we honor Him. Yes. And once we honor Him, we love Him. Amen. And Jeremiah 17, 7, okay, blessed is the man who trusts in the Lord. Yes. Why? Why? How blessed is the man who trusts the Lord. Yes. I want to open it. And okay. But this is a Tagalog one, okay? Why it is blessed? Okay, he said here, for he will be like in seventeen seven in seventeen eight, for he will be like a tree planted by the water. Yes. That extend its roots. Okay, by a stream and will not fear when heat comes. That's right. Why? Because he is in the oh, he is filled with water, right? Yes, he is. Filled. Yeah. Yes, just filled. like just like your your spiritual life. Yes. You are always in the presence of the Lord. You are always filled to the brim. In his yeah, presence. Yeah, in yes. his presence. In his and, presence. Yeah. And whatever hit, okay? Yes. You will never fear because whatever drought may come into your life, you, know, you will never get you know, dried up. You'll never get burned out because this the presence of the Lord overwhelm you. Yes. Amen. Overwhelm us. And it says here in uh, in seventeen eight of Jeremiah, but its leaves will be green. Yes. And it will not be anxious in a year of drought, Amen. nor cease to yield fruit in spite of drought. Yes. Uh, the tree will never stop bearing fruit. That's Just right. like a spiritual life. Okay? In, in Tagalog, I will read it. 17.7 to 8 of Jeremiah. Mapalad ang mga taong nagtitiwala kay Yahweh. Pagpapalain ang umaasa sa kanya. Ikaw ba yun? Ikaw ba yun? Ikaw ba yun? Is it you? Yeah, because I am one of them. Amen? Hallelujah. Katulad niya ay isang punong kahoy na nakatanin sa tabi ng batisan. Ang mga ugat ay patungo sa tubig. Hindi ito mga nganib kahit dumating ang tag-init. Okay. Sapagkat mananatiling luntian or berde ang mga dahon nito. Kahit hindi umulan ay wala itong alalanganin. Because he is planted beside this tree. He has no worry at all. At patuloy pa rin itong namumunga, just like him. At patuloy kang nakababad sa presensya mo yun. If your household, you always soak yourselves in the presence of the Most High God. You will continue to flourish, flourish in spite of all circumstances, drought, yes. floods, whatever may come. Whatever circumstances may come into our lives, into our family, into our churches, still, 
We will yes. continue to flourish because the Spirit of God is life. Yes. And if we live in His Word and if we trust in Him, yes, we, do. we will continue to soar high yes. like an eagle flying in the midst of the typhoon to hit the eye of the typhoon and to break it yes. and to say, I have victory over it. Amen? Yes, we do. Yes. yes. So that's it. And uh, how I wish, I'm hoping that everyone who is watching right now will be blessed by the word of God that we had able to share. Because our God is able, He can always do His promises yes. from His living word. Amen? Amen. So, how oh, I wish, I love, I, lo I really love to sing this song, Hallelujah. The, Jesus got a hold of my life. Hallelujah. Jesus got a hold of our family. Amen? Yes. And he won't let us go. But we have a choice. So what is your choice today? Yes. So I want my husband to sing here with me, maybe. You yes. can sing there. Oh, they maybe they just want to see you. Oh, well, maybe, maybe that they, uh, I mean... Saying, wow, she's a whole lot better looking than he is. Yes, that's why I married her. Because she's, yes, that's why. Because she's pretty. I don't know if Jesus I can get, get on the camera. And he won't let me go. Oh. Jesus got a hold of my life. He got into my, my soul. soul. I used to be oh so sad, but now I guess we ain't glad. Jesus got a hold of my life, and he won't let me go. Oh, yeah, my husband is coming. Yeah, Come, my I'm love. To, well, we will repeat the song again. Well, let's we'll try it again. I have to be behind your guitar. No. I don't think it's going to work. It works. No, the guitar is longer than the camera. It's okay. You zoom it. No, I'm going to go I all the way out. I just want to please everyone where God is in your family too. Mm, we'll try that. And we want to please God all the time. For God is good. Amen. Jesus got a hold of my life, and He won't let me go. Jesus got a hold of my life, He got into my soul. I used to be so sad, but now I'm just being glad. Jesus got a hold of my life, and He won't let me go. Jesus got a hold of my life, and He won't let me go. Jesus 
has got a hold of my life and he won't let me go. Jesus got a hold of my heart, so that is my soul. I used to be oh, so sad, but now I'm just as free and So sad, but now I'm just a free and glad because Jesus has got a hold of my life and He won't let me go. Jesus has got a hold of my life and He won't let me go. Amen. Thank yeah. you, my love. And maybe good singer, you are making me maybe, sound better. Yeah, maybe we can pray for. Household now, I want you to pray for them. All right. Hallelujah. Yeah. Well, Household, churches, the nation, everything. Well, Hallelujah. Dear Heavenly Father, yes, Father, we thank you that you are in control. We yes, ask Lord. that your kingdom come yes, Lord, and Lord. that your will would be Amen. done in our hearts, yes, Lord, in Lord. our lives, as it is in heaven. We ask that your kingdom come yes, and that your will would be done. Amen. Yes, we want you yes, to have your way. Amen. Lord, those Amen. who are smart, they they want to be in your presence Amen. every single yes. day. Amen. Because we, uh, we know that in your presence there is fullness of joy. Yes, and God. in your presence, yes, yes, yes we Lord. can receive our bread on a daily basis, yes, yes in your presence. As we come into your presence. Yes, Father, forgive us of our sins oh, yes, Lord. as we forgive yes. those who sin against Amen. us. Lord, your word teaches us, you teach us that we must forgive others and if we don't, we don't have forgiveness either. Lord, help us to uh, uh, not to be tempted Lord, you tempt no one with evil, but every good and perfect gift comes yes. down from the yes, Father. Yes, Lord, Lord answers you, to prayer, yes. they come from you. Amen. Every good and perfect gift yes, comes Lord. from you. Yes, Lord. Lord, those who are sick, yes, they Lord. can rise up because Amen. of the good. Yes, Lord, you Lord. grant to people more time yes, and, uh, and to complete every assignment that you yes, have Lord. for them you do it all the time you yes. grant more time yes. and then yes. no yes. one will leave until you say so yes for yours is the kingdom Amen. yours Amen. is the Jesus. power Jesus. yours is the glory Amen. it Jesus. all becomes belongs to you yes. we thank you father because yes. you move Yes, you Lord. answer prayer yes, and you Lord. receive Jesus. all of the glory. Yes, oh Lord. All of it. Amen. It all belongs to you. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' Thank name. You, Jesus. Thank you, Lord God. Amen. As the Christmas had come, hallelujah, and everyone enjoy. We we just hope that everyone remembers the birth of Jesus Christ who came to the world to save the world. And those who believe in Him should not perish but have everlasting life. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. May we continue to pray for the whole world, O oh Lord. Continue save soul for every household, O oh Lord. We love them. We know that you love them too, and we love them too. We have all the passion. We have all the compassion to each and every soul that we met. They don't know Jesus. Lord, continue to help us. And we are praying for the great provisions to come more open heaven blessings, O oh Lord. Because our, our moves is just so very limited, O oh Lord. We just minister in this uh, in this uh, kind of, uh, in this way of uh, ministering people so we can reach the whole world, O oh Lord. But we 
if we have much, if we have enough money, oh Lord, yes, we Lord. can go around places to places, oh Lord, and could bless more people. Not only sharing the word of God, but we can bless them with our goodness that comes from you. Hallelujah. So we are praying. Continue to bless us and open heaven blessings, oh Lord, in all kinds of blessings, oh Lord. Hallelujah. We are praying also. Hallelujah. That you continue to bless our nations, our world, uh, this world, oh Lord, that is full of hopeless people. They are distracted with all this, uh, this troubles, this uh, uh, pandemic, this virus, this uh, 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 situation of the world, oh Lord. Everyone is in anxious uh, situation, oh Lord. But thank you because you have led us to be in you, to trust you, to be faithful in you, to love you, hallelujah, and to continue to live in you and to obey your will. Thank you, Jesus. For for everyone, it is not easy yeah. to think how we are doing for you. But we have all the joy, overwhelming joy, that we can do our best to yeah. praise your heart, that we can do our best, O oh Lord, to bring more souls in your presence. Yeah. And then to bring them in the throne of the race, that they may be saved, oh Lord. And we're thankful for those who support us also. Hallelujah. Thank you for touching more hearts, touching more souls, touching more people, that they may be saved, uh, save, oh Lord. And also, thank you for all these people that you are using, hallelujah, to be an instrument for for us, oh Lord, that we can continue to mission, hallelujah, wherever we are. Hallelujah. Bless their life, bless their household, bless their spiritual life, bless their service on you, oh Lord. And, and, and we are praying, oh Lord, that they will continue to be with you. Hallelujah, in your word, be gentle in your word. And we're praying more, more, more blessings to come in their household. And you will protect them, O oh Lord. You will continue to bless them. Their businesses, O oh Lord, hallelujah. You will give more favor. Their, their, their works, their job of more promotions, hallelujah, will come to them. And more peaceful and joyful household they could have in you because everyone obeys in your word to do your will. Thank you, Lord God. Bless those who watch here online. Bless them all. Bless them. Not only in, in the material things that they need in finances, but bless them physically and spiritually. We are praying that your spirit would continue to win them, oh Lord, hallelujah, as we hope right now, speak mightily and boldly and pray for their souls, yes. hallelujah, in the name of Jesus, thank you for the life of my beloved husband who keeps on trusting you, oh Lord, hallelujah, bless his life, bless him more abundantly in anointing, wisdom, and boldness to share your word with the love and compassion. Thank you. Thank you for this relationship that you did for us because you had bind us together Amen. to do your will and have the love and passion like what you have in your heart. In Jesus' name. Amen. We give you all the glory and honor. Okay. Father, amen.
see you next time around. That yes, will be a bad yes, yes, yes.